Amelia, are you from Toronto? Are you from uh, Montreal? No. Where are you from? I'm from Indianapolis, Indiana. Oh. Yes. Very interesting. All right. Yes. <laughs> and Antoine, where are you from? I'm from Montreal. You're from Montreal. Yes. So what is the winter like in Indianapolis? Well, it's pretty much like it is here, only a little less cold. It can be harsh, it can be mild, the ice is fierce. So what, how many years have you been here in Montreal? Uh, almost three. Were you surprised by this winter when you got here? No, because I spent a year at Interlock in Michigan, and that snow is like this high. And it's, it has the ice and cold, too. Okay, so in short, I would love to talk to you about von Eva Galiba after the class. Can we do okay, that? That's fine. But can we work on can we work on Barber? Sure. I cannot. Did you did you get the words of what she was saying in Barber? No. You want to say the words one time? Sure. Sure. On this. So, it's in, it's important to remember that this these words are written by a man who was alcoholic, homosexual. He did not particularly have the most friendly view of the world. He had not had a good home life. He was, it was very difficult for him. And now he talks in this poem about the fact that spring and summer have finally come. And you know, I thought when I was sitting there listening to you sing, I thought this is a perfect song for today for Montreal. Because even though it's raining outside, it's not snowing. She says, the late year lies down the north. It's gone up, up there. That's north, right? Yep. Is that correct? Okay. <laughs> the winter came down here, but it's gone back there now. All is health. All is healed. High summer holds the earth. Hearts all whole. Aren't these beautiful words? Sure, on this shining night, I weep for wonder at shadows on the stars, right? Wandering far, Wandering far alone. Wandering far alone at shadows on the stars. Okay, now say, can you say the poem from the beginning? And say it with intention. Or as I tell my students at Manhattan School, with talent. <laughs> you know, it's not enough to say the words. Say the words as if you mean them, whether you do or not. <laughs> and let's see what happens, okay? Sure, I... Sure, on this shining night, of stars made shadows round, kindness must watch for me, this side of the ground. Say it one more time. You know what it means? Can you say it in your own words? What do you mean? In your words, Amelia, not the words of Aji, but the, your words. How would you say what you just said in your words? You understand what I'm asking her to do? Yes, Like, it's a certain way, like, translate from English to English. <laughs> yeah. That's more difficult than translating French to English. I understand that. I understand that. <laughs> But you see, if you are going to make a, an efficient and effective communication, you have to know and believe what you are saying. I tell people, you know, you can, you can sing, if you sing Bach B minor mass, you do not have to be Christian to sing Bach B minor mass. You don't. People sing that piece successfully of all religions. But in that moment, you had better well believe it. Because if you don't, Believe me, there are a thousand people behind you who are dying for the chance to sing, and they believe it. Get out of the way and let them sing. That's what I tell people. So here we go. So what, what, what is your, how would you say what you just said? Sure on this shining night. It's, it's, sure, say it one more time what he wrote. Sure on this shining night of star, yeah. Sure on this shining night of stars made shadows around. Okay, you got that picture? Sure, on this shining night of stars made shadows round, kindness must watch for me this side the ground. Great. Now, what, did, now, what are you saying in, in Amelia E's? What are you saying? It's definite in this beautiful evening. I need someone to 
to watch over me. I need someone to be with me. And to be kind. Yes, to, to take care of me. Yes, that's very important. Yes. You see what I'm talking I'm about? down on me. Yes. I feel them watching me. Now, so you understand. Now, say the words, the original words, one more time, with that meaning. Sure, on this shining night of stars made shadows round, kindness must watch for me this side the ground. Yeah, good. For example, what do you mean when you say this side the ground? As in, I'm on Earth and they're not. Well, no. The stars for me are. The, the, the ground has this side and that side. Right. Who are the people underneath? Well, the unworthy. They're dead. Yes. You are living, okay. and somebody there. I'm still alive, yes. You are still alive. Right. This side, the ground. I have not been right. buried yet. I am not dead. I have not been buried. No. And so, someone who is alive can show me some kindness. Somebody can show me some kindness. Kindness must, must watch, watch for, for me, me this side the ground. Yeah? Yes. Okay? Keep going. So the late year? The, the late year rides down the north. Yeah, lies down the north. Yeah. The late year lies down the north. All is healed. All is healed. All is health. High summer holds the earth. Now, say that in Amelia Eve. In Amelia East? <laughs> yeah. High summer holds the earth? No, no, the whole thing. Um, the, late, the late year the lies winter, down the north. The winter is, the winter is gone. High, the winter, highs, oh. yeah. The late year rides down the north, all is healed, all, all is healed, all is health. All is healed, all is health. What does that mean, all is healed, all is health? I mean, the poet's talking about himself. Okay, I'm, you, are, you are the person speaking. What does that mean? All is, I'm, I'm, I've, I've filled in my holes. I've filled in my wounds. I've, I've, I've patched them over. I've, I've found a new place finally. I've, I've understood my mistakes. And so high summer. Feel good? It feels really good. High summer was here. It feels fabulous. The sun is shining. It's yes. not snowing anymore on me no. in my life. It's not a storm in my life anymore. There are anymore. no more gray clouds all the time, every single day. But That's right. Here. Now say the original words. Okay. The late year. The late year rides down the north. No, it lies down. I'm not hearing that clearly. Lies down. To yeah. Like it went back there, and it's gone. <laughs> here. The, late year, the late year lies down the north. All is healed. All is health. High summer holds the earth. Heart all whole. Sure on this shining night, I weep for wonder, wandering far alone of shadows on the stars. Great. Now let's sing the song. You'd be surprised, you'd be surprised how many people, they sing in, in their language, people sing in French, and they don't understand what they're saying in French. People sing in English, they don't know what they're saying in English. People sing in German, they don't know what they're saying in German. I'm talking about Germans who don't know what they're saying in German. You understand? <laughs> you, you, sometimes you have to talk about it and get, get the meaning. And now, let's, now sing the, Poetry, yes. Yeah, let's sing the song now, let's see what happens, yeah? So, so uh, tell me, Antoine, so you are understanding all of this, right? You are understanding all of this? Yes. Okay, now do you have a similar feeling about this music? About the fact that it's no longer winter? That it's, it's, it's warm? Yeah? I, I think so, yes. <laughs> okay, so show us that when you play. Show us the warmest tone that you have. You know, one of my teachers said to me one time, and I 100% and I, and I believe it. When you play the, well, if you come out of a recital from a singer, I guarantee you that the first thing people talk about is the quality of the voice. If the first thing, when you come out of a voice concert, if the first thing that you say to the person beside you is that that was amazing staccato, 
then you have, you have a problem in the voice concert. If, that, if, the, if the amazing staccato was what you carried out of the concert, the singer has a problem. The thing that people note is the tone of someone's voice, the quality of their voice. Then they start to talk about other things. We have to do the same thing with the piano. The tone that you make is the bottom of the building. It is this foundation that you have. That is what the bottom, that's the bottom. That's the thing that you build everything on is the quality of your tone when you play. So show us beautiful tone all the way through, as warm as you can. Like, give me a beautiful warm bath, okay? Let's see what happens. Can we stop for one second? Do y'all hear a difference in the way she is singing now? And it's not from anything except that she understands what she is saying. <laughs> that was beautiful. Yeah? Do, it. Do it again. Let's see what happens. Okay. When I say, and one thing to remember always, when they say do it again, do not do it again. You are going to do the music again. But do not try to do that again. No. Do something new. You have to always, always create. Not recreate. Recreate is boring. The definition of, oh, yes. So create again. See what happens. You know, with all due respect, with all due respect, Amelia, you are now once again singing. No. Do not sing. Speak and say the words. Express the words. Right. This is my job. I know. Do not sing to me. I don't care about your singing. Your singing will be beautiful. Give the words. For example, it's not nah. Night. Thank you, God. Here we go.
Uh, good, good, good. Can we talk about one more thing? Yeah. The end of the piece, do you realize, Antoine, you know, do, you, do you either of you go to church? I used to. You used to. <laughs> Never. Have you been in some kind of uh, concert where you heard some, the mezzos sing the melody and the sopranos make some kind of disc and up here like that on it? I, I, yeah? Yes, I think so, yeah. Okay, now in the end of the piece, you were playing the melody, Antoine. You have and you are singing like the choir woman upstairs. You are singing sure on this shining night like that, yeah? And you have to give that. You have to give more melody and you have to give the feeling of flying yes. at the end. Because I am. Yes, exactly. Okay? And then I have to talk to you about one more thing. Okay. I'm coming there, wait a minute. Let me see if I can take off my glasses. So now, you are doing this with your eyes. I mean, are you are going. Do not search. Okay, here's today's lighting lesson. On, I don't care what color your skin is, there are three places on your body that reflect the light more than the other part of your body. They are the whites of your eyes and your teeth. Okay? People as far back as at the back of the Metropolitan Opera can see the whites of your eyes. Yes. And when, when the eyes are doing this, they're going... Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. This is not focused. No. And then they do not hear you in a focused way. You have to find a place. See, I'm blind about these. I don't see anything. You would be amazed if you saw what I'm seeing right now. <laughs> because I don't see any people. It's just the big thing. But for example, I can see one thing back there that's like a light or something. Yes. Okay, so if I just sing to that, or if I just, is there someone there in that row that has something like, like yellow on? Yes. Okay, see, I cannot see what it is, but it looks like yellow, okay? okay. So you, you just can sing to that, or you can sing there, or you can sing there, or there. But you cannot be wandering. Not literally. Okay. So let's find it. Let's find it. Think about where you want. When, I would like for you to. You cannot sing all in the same place all the time. But if you, if you find a place that you want to change your focus, where would it be in the last page? There. No, but I'm talking about the music. In the music? Yeah. Let's say that you start the last page looking one place. And you say, sure, on this shiny night, I weep for wonder. Yes. Right? Wandering far alone. Stars. Of shadows on the stars, right? Is that what it is? Yeah, we changed it on the stars. Okay, that's fine. You pick where you like. Okay, now, now I want you to look at one place while you sing the first, and when you come to the word stars, look at a different place, and you only look two places. <laughs> Good. Here we go. Let's see what happens. So, can we do um, the last page? And you are playing, the, or you know, you know what I mean when I say the last page. When you, when you start the melody, yeah, okay. And fly and look at one place and then another place. Here we go. And give the words and give the expression. Here we go. Excuse me, Antoine. That was, that was much more beautiful. Do you see the difference that it makes in her body and in her singing? See, this is, it has an amazing ability. The eyes have an amazing ability to focus the rest of your body, to make your support better, to make your voice better. But the minute that you are doing this, everything in your body is doing that. Yeah. Antoine, that was beautiful melody. Yeah? Do it one more time. And again, just focus. I, can, can I ask you to change your focus one other place? 
or, or another place, I should say. Okay. If you said, I weep for wonder, you have a rest right there? Yeah. Do it right there. Like, here's the, here's the part before, and then I, I weep for wonder, wandering, and then sing the rest there. See what happens. Focus, keep the focus, keep the focus. That's it. Good. Good. Thank you. 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 Thank you.